It's interesting because he does a very opulent sort of collection and what he wanted from the hair and makeup was to something quite minimalist and quite um, masculine, which I thought was a really great direction to go in for you know, a woman to wear those clothes that have a lot of color and have a lot going on. You want to present yourself in a very strong way. excited about where he's taking his brand and it feels like it's gone in a whole new direction and I'm just excited to, to come and see. The main influence this season in my collection is a sort of Spanish theme, um, not necessarily a conventional look at matador and flamenco, and I wanted to do something a little more subtle and more modern than that, but that was definitely the starting point. There's always, I hope, consistency from one collection to the next, so it's the same girl, um, the same woman. Um, there's always a sort of richness of fabrics and textures and colours. I think that's a sort of consistent thing. Um, but nonetheless, it's about having a signature and then evolving it so it doesn't become repetitious. So hopefully this is an evolution of spring and summer. I've got quite a few favourites. Yeah, I love them all. They're, we've, we've obsessed about, you know, any looks that we should drop. And so it's sort of edited down to my top favourite 41 looks. <laughs>